three 0 performance for the Rocks. How are you and Jack viewing that after today? Yeah, um, just really pleased. Um, I think first first half were a little bit wasteful with our passing um, and our final decision making, but we had a chat at half time uh, and said that we needed to to go wide, use our fitness, which we thought would tell in the end and the pace we had up front, and just keep the ball simple, keep the ball moving. And I think we did that to be fair in the second half and. The longer the game went on, you could see that we were just getting a little bit more stronger, we were a bit more fitter than them, and um, you know, I think that seeing the goals at the end, there was um, some good goals again. Do you feel that that was a much better performance than the one against Nordstrom? Yes, I think because we, we, I think they were very dangerous at set pieces, throw-ins, corners, free kicks. I think that was they were. I thought today that was the only way they were going to score, um, but you know, I thought we just, you know. Rode that a little bit in the second half, like I say, and we got a little bit more disciplined, a little bit more clever with our passing, um, which resulted in us going forward and, and, and scoring some goal, good goals. And yeah, I think the, I think as a progression, we're more happy than today than we were on Tuesday. But I think the important thing for us on Thursday as we're training was, you know, we had every you know player here so we could do a bit of shape and a bit of team play at work. And so I think you know we've seen some good goals tonight. So hopefully they've took that on board and um, you know. Hopefully it'll stand as a good stead for the next couple of games coming up. Do you see it as a positive that Jimmy Mirip is obviously not happy about being taken off? Do you see that as a positive from Yeah, why wouldn't, you? why wouldn't you? I mean, it's easy to sit this side of the fence and say, I was exactly the same when I was a player. You don't, and it's, it's, it's a sign of somebody cares and somebody wants to stay on and wants to do well. And I think he was more frustrated at the fact of, obviously... Which I didn't know at the time. He takes the penalty, so obviously it was a bit of a, a bit of a double blow for Jim to come off and um, and not score. But I think you know he got a he got a he got a clatter down here, um, which was a hard hit. And I just think we just try to look after him a little bit. And ten minutes to go, in my opinion, the game was won. So we decided to, to make the change, and obviously Mason's going to come in and be a good addition for us. Talking about Mason Walsh leading me very nicely on. Thank you, Robbie. How big a coup is he to, to have at the club? He's a great signing. Isn't Brilliant he? signing for us. Something that we can look forward to. Something, somebody we can work with. He's got electrifying pace. Um, he can go both ways. We've seen that he can get his shots off. He makes good decisions. And, and you know, let's not forget he's probably not played a lot of football of late. So for him to be in a situation now where he's going to get some game time, he's only going to get improved and get better. So. Um, fingers crossed for that and you know like you say it's a great coup for the club and for us I will be honest with some more of a question for myself is yeah. it a loan signing or a permanent signing I think it's a permanent signing as far as I'm aware so uh, you know probably Jack's a better person to ask him that but far, as far as I'm aware it's a permanent signing so that's going to be a great addition well hopefully it's, uh, I, think, I think I'm pretty sure it is so it, like I say it's going to be a great addition for us Winning your home games, drawing your away games. We hit the road again on yeah. on Saturday against Ayrshire Hornchurch. That's not going to be an easy game, as, as they always are. No, Lee, I don't think any game's easy in this league, is it? And you know, we beat Merson three one, and they were they were quite lively, weren't they? They were a good side, and uh, you know, you, when you see the first game, you, you may be disappointed with a two two draw, thinking are they really a good side? And you've probably got to give them respect because they went away from one midweek and won two 0 So. We, who knows how good that point will have been to get us on the road so um, yeah I think if we can nick a few wins and, and, and certainly don't get beat away from home and hopefully our, our own form really good then that should stand us in good stead Robbie pleasure as always thank you very much